All right, Shalom. This is Brother Danyala coming back again with another lesson. But first off, all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweshai, Bahashim Arakak Wadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great, Mill of Great Millstone. And Shalom to the uh, hopeful elect teaching and pushing this word in sincerity and in truth. All right, so uh, I'm going to try to make this, you know, uh, to be a, a quick hit. You know, or, or you know, if the spirit makes me go into, uh, makes it a little longer, so be it. But um, I was on my way home from work, you know, and um, I got an email. I was, you know, scrolling through the emails. You know how it is. Uh, scrolling through my emails, and I got an email from the bank that I'm with, which is uh, uh, PNC. So I got an email from there, and it inspired this video. So I'm gonna go ahead and. Uh, share the email with you guys this is uh yeah so this is uh this is the email it says uh pnc bank the future is cardless now you can also use the pnc mobile app to bank at pnc atms all right so now it's getting to the point where you can you can is they're, they're starting to make things convenient now right it says the future yeah like i like i just read salakia the future is cardless right so first you started off we started off with a uh, physical money right you know uh, 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 which, which is not really money but a uh, 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 physical uh, um physical material right which they they added value to right so first we started off with the dollars right they're actually tangible you can touch them you exchange them, right? The coins, right? But now uh, uh, they, they they introduce the card, right? So then you got the card, and then you have the the barcode on, on on the back of the card, right? Then they introduce the chip on the card. Boom! Now they're going cardless, right? So they they're gradually, you know, but surely making everything convenient for this uh, RFID microchip to be uh, pushed, which is the mark of the beast, right? And we're gonna get that in the scriptures. Okay, so let me see if I read, read a little bit more here. It says, with PNC card-free ATM access, you can bank with ease without your physical card, right? And A, that's the, that's, that's the convenience of the chip, being able to do all these different uh, digital transactions, all right, or di digital management without having a physical card or physical money, right? So that you can buy and sell, okay? It says... Uh, Withdraw cash, check your balance, and handle all other ATM transactions with with your mobile device at at a PMC ATM near you. Right? And uh it says here how here's how to make card free ATM transactions. Right, it's just giving you the breakdown on how you how you make these different transactions, you know. And you know anybody with uh, PNC, they're probably sending this out. You know any of the brothers, with, uh, who, who who's at the same bank, they're probably getting this. Uh, you know, uh, uh, email also, right? But that's the point right there. Cardless, right? Cause soon the whole society is gonna go cardless, right? And then they're gonna uh, implement this microchip. So let's go. Let's go ahead and get that, right? We're gonna show that the microchip is is is, is you won't be able to buy or sell without without that mark. All right, as, as it says, this is a, I'll just read it, Salakia. This is um, Revelations chapter 13 and verse 16. And he causeth all, both small and great, so no matter uh, uh, what, what uh, uh, social class you're in, right, whether you're small or great, rich and poor, no matter if you got money, you don't have money, right, uh, you know, rich sitting in the penthouse, bum on the street, it says free and bond, Right, all out walking amongst the people or, 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 or uh, 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 incarcerated, right? Free or born to receive a mark in their right hand or in their forehead, right? And that no man might buy or sell save he had the mark or the num or the name of the beast or the number of his name, right? So. There you go, man. And in and, and, and this uh this mark that is being described 
is, is uh, we're going to get that. This is, uh, you got to go back into the Greek to understand. It says, this is, this is, Salaki, I'm, I'm out here. It's all types of bugs craw crawling on me. Um, it says, uh, this is G5480. Uh, and the word there in the Greek is uh, charagma, all right, charagma, all right, which means a stamp, an imprinted mark, okay, it says a mark stamped on the forehead or the right hand as a badge of the followers of the Antichrist, but there's, there's many Antichrists according to the scriptures, right, it says uh, the mark branded on horses, it says thing carved, Sculpture, graven work, idolatrous images, Im Im images, right? But the point is, uh, 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 a thing carved, all right, or an imprinted mark, right? It's, it's, it's that, that, that actual chip, that's the karagma, okay? That's the thing that they carve into your skin, underneath your skin, right? And, and let's get that word uh, carve, which that should go back to, uh, to cut out. Right, let's just get that real quick. Carve. It says, uh, this is uh, carve. Right. It says, Middle English curving. Uh, initial K is from, inf is from influence of Scandinavian forms. From Old English. Uh, uh Corfon class uh, class three strong verb past tense kerf past participle corfin to cut also to cut down slay to cut out right it says uh, from West Ger uh, Germanic Kerbanon uh, source of old old uh, uh, Frisian curva all right um middle dutch and dutch curving german curving to cut notch right and, 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 and to notch when uh, you know they make a little uh, uh they look make a little notch all right into your skin right so they cut they cut into your skin so carve to cut right so thing carved right the thing that's carved the uh the you know the mark Okay, the, the RFID microchip, that's the thing that's carved under your skin, right? And it says, um, you know, and, uh, right, I mean, I, I could get more. You can go into, uh, G5482, which is going into a pail or a stake. And that's that needle or syringe that they use to actually stick or carve the chip into you, right? It says it says here, it goes back into the Greek word karax. It says a pale or a stake, palisade, a palisade or rampart, right? And the pale is just a sharp instrument, all right, that you use to uh, to cut into something, all right? So. Uh, but the point here is in 17, man, it says that no man might buy or sell, say, if you have the mark, right? And what do you go, what do you go to the bank for, right? You go to the bank to get money, to put money in, right? And what do you use money, what do you use money for? You use money to buy things, and you, mo you also use money to sell things, right? So these, uh, you know, these digital uh, transactions are going to become more convenient, Right? As you can see here uh, at PNC with the ATMs, it's going to become more convenient to not even, you won't have to stick your card into the ATM anymore, right? That's just a step closer to, to, to Esau pushing this, this mark of the beast, you know, this, 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 this microchip society, right? Making everything convenient.